Yo, what's going on everybody? It's our pod King Carter here, the super mini YouTube. Now, wait, wait, wait. Before you guys even think I'm here to bash NBA Live, no, I'm not. I'm here to actually talk some good things about them, so fall back. <laughs> nah, man, Um, I just want to give you guys some news on NBA Live 14 for, you know, those who may not know. Uh, Before I get into this, at the end of the video, if you find it intriguing, if you like what I talked about, you know I'm saying definitely leave this video a like. Go in the description, dabble around, make sure you follow me on Twitter mostly. Uh, Twitter is where I get back to, you know, all the people who follow me, tweet me, you know, on the day to day. I try my best though. I get a lot of tweets, but I try my best. But let's get into it. Now, NBA Live 14, right? They decided to host a Twitter chat on their Twitter. Now, I'm going to give you guys their um, joint. It's EA Sports nba all one word so if you want to go on twitter follow them tweet them about their game definitely do that it looks to me like they do get back to the uh fans and stuff like that but <clears throat> the two main guys the gameplay designer scott o'gallagher and the executive producer sean o'brien decided you know what we're going to host a chat and we're going to actually answer any type of questions that people may have now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over what they talked about, and I'm actually going to leave another link in the description to actually send you to the article. Now, a couple things that have been revealed for NBA Live 14. Yes, I said reveal, not, you know, oh, they're, they're, they're still going to come out with different. No, I'm just going to tell you what they revealed, and then you can make your decision on if it was good information for me, for me or if it wasn't. Now, they said that they're going to have team-specific playbooks and team-specific defenses. So, that means if you're playing up against the Miami Heat, don't expect them to be strong in the paint, you know, against, you know, taller centers and stuff like that. And definitely look for them to be on a running gun. Now, uh, the AI will be driven by real-world data from Court Q. Now, what Court Q is, is basically... Their player DNA system. All it is is whenever, say, Kyrie Irving plays a game, he does horrible. And then the next two games, he plays great. Every day it will update. So his value will either go down or go up, deciding on how he plays. So his ratings need to stay up. He needs to stay good. But uh, <laughs> shot percentages will be determined by different contest levels. That means if a hand is in your face, that's that's one of the, the hardest contested shots. Um, if a guy is, you know, starting to run up to you after you already missed shot, then it's not contested well enough, so it may get knocked down. So all I'm saying is it ain't going to be no phantom you making threes with three, four defenders all over you. <laughs> it's going to be like in real life. Uh, fatigue will affect player speed and performance. So that means if you got a 99 LeBron James and you've been playing him for four quarters straight, Expect him not to be, you know, up to par on the same level as when he begun the game, please. All right, now, player access accessories will be player likeness will remain in lockstep daily and throughout the year. Now, from what I read here is whatever the player starts with, I guess in the beginning of the season, maybe that's what they'll wear all throughout the season. If they decide to add something new, I don't know if they will be able to, you know, upgrade it. I know they probably can give a nice little roster update, but I don't think that they'll be looking for it every single day. But, you know, that's just me. Uh, the Ignite engine will improve animation quality, physics, and fluidity. Uh, now, from what I saw, you know, with the bounce tech and all of that, the bouncing and everything is looking good, but I do want to see some of that good old gameplay to determine what the animations look like, what the physics looks like, and how fluid it actually is. Now, it says you can get dunked on and see various animations. None of the animations are canned, which means... When we play NBA 2K and you go into a dunk animation, you know you have posterizer on. You, you know, tend to know what type of animation you're going to get. But I'm guessing what Live is saying is if you go in the paint with Blank Griffin and you go up against Paul Gasol, are you going to get that same animation where dude just like, no, please don't dunk on me? <laughs> like, will that happen or will it be an animation where as though a person just puts his hand up and goes chest to chest and get, gets dunked on? We won't know. Um, also, 5-on-5 five five gameplay, it will be shown in the summer. Now, I know it's summertime, 
So, you know, just hold off. I know y'all want to go crazy in the comment section, but maybe it will be happening later this summer. Also, it will come along with a full list of game moves. So, either in the middle or end of the summer, we will know what live is going to bring to the table. Also, guys, don't forget, live is only coming out on Xbox One and PS4. So, do not get your hopes up for Xbox 360 and PS3. All right. One big thing that they said, oh boy, I know a lot of 2K fans going to be going, wow, you can block dunks in NBA Live 14. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> For all you guys out there that, you know, love blocking shots, you're good to go. Dunk packages are in the game for NBA Live 14. So if you want to build up a package or preset packages or whatever, hey, there you go. Authentic Arenas, ESPN TV presentation so you know they got the license ain't much more i can say about that they've had it for a while now and now it's time for, for them to try to use it it's a new locomotion system results in authentic movement so i'm guessing whatever a player does in real life hopefully in nba live 14 they will mimic mimic it to as close as it is in real life now uh, it says yes you will be able to call inbound plays okay pretty cool um we've been able to do that for a while now <laughs> um nba live 14 will feature legends wow okay okay nba live 14 will feature legends now you already know there was the first person with mj i'm just saying so you know <laughs> when it comes to legends they might they might oh man i don't, I don't even want to think about it you know as long as they got the doctor i'm good to go but uh it says there will be all types of putbacks as in probably put back dunks put back layups maybe you know uh, come off a rebound you leak into the paint i don't know i don't know I, I need to see this you know they can talk about it. they can talk a good game but i need to see it um they also said that they have the number one espn nba team and a surprise is coming later so when i think number one espn nba team we know that it's not international but when they see say espn nba team it's not going to be team usa is it it's not going to be like an olympic team is this going to it must be like a, a set of superstars put all on one team and they're just probably going to have some type hey they said a surprise is coming i'm not going to get too deep into it cool with me um, they said that sliders will be in the game, but this is the big question. Will you guys have sliders in all of your modes? That's the big question. All right. It says 40 players with signature moves plus packages. And it says mellow confirmed. Now, what I'm trying to figure out here is signature moves plus packages mellow confirmed. Does that mean Carmelo Anthony has his own signature move and package? I don't know. We will have to see. Uh, it also says authenticity is the biggest emphasis of the game. It says along with everything at the team level, styles of play and coaches, etc. So I guess what they're saying here is. You know how a team is going to be ran. You know how the team is going to play. But the style of play is going to be determined probably through coaches, the way that the their teammates interact with each other. I don't know. I can't get too much into it. But what I can do for you guys is let you know that the link is in the description. It is to the article. You can read it yourself. You can go into NBA Live 14's actual Twitter uh, page, which is EA Sports NBA. Check them out. Hit them up. But my job is done here. Hopefully, I dropped some good news on y'all heads. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, y'all like this video. But this is IKC signing out. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video, man. I'm, I think I might do a little bit of my career with my team tonight. I don't know. <laughs> but I'm out. Peace.